is NBC Connecticut News at 11. Pump problems, the messy situation and major headaches for homeowners in one Connecticut community. But first, an update parents will want to listen up for. What we're learning about a hidden poison in some food. New developments this morning into the dangerous levels of arsenic found in some baby formulas and some other foods labeled organic. Brad Drazen joins us now with more. And Brad, this report is definitely alarming. No question about it. Parents and grandparents are going to want to listen up to this story. There's a new study out about arsenic. It occurs naturally in the environment. But now the poison has also been found in some organic baby food. Scientists at Dartmouth College found high levels of the poison in organic brown rice syrup, which is commonly used as a sweetener. The so-called hidden arsenic was discovered in two toddler formulas made by Nature's One. Unsettling news to parents. I don't know what brown rice syrup is in the first place, so I, I can't really trust it, especially with allergies. You don't know who's allergic to what. One formula had six times the amount of arsenic considered safe by the EPA. I wouldn't consume that if, if I had known that, and I certainly wouldn't give it to my child. Arsenic was also found in 22 out of 29 cereal or energy bars that contained rice syrup, rice flour, rice grain, or rice flakes. When you're exposed to mild arsenic, the biggest concern with our children are neurodevelopmental delays because it will affect cognition, it will affect learning, it'll lower your IQ scores. Naturopathic Dr. Jared Scourn advises parents to get their children tested. Once used as a pesticide, arsenic tends to stay in the soil where it's absorbed by new crops like rice. Long-term exposure has been linked to cancer. In recent months, the Dr. Oz Show and Consumer Reports have both reported finding high levels of arsenic in apple and grape juice. And while the EPA regulates the amount of arsenic allowed in water, there are no regulations on arsenic in juice or food. We think it's time for the government to set standards to lower the levels of arsenic and lead in the juices and foods that our families consume. Just today, the FDA said it began studying arsenic levels in rice last fall. Yvonne? And Brett, I have to ask you, has there been a response from the company that manufactures the baby food? Yeah, that's Nature's One. They maintain their independent tests have shown arsenic levels were undetectable in the toddler formula. All right, Brad, thanks.